We want to continue our economic coverage now. More business, residential properties, and public green space could soon line the streets of downtown Roanoke. Right now, the city planning office is considering a few major changes in the downtown area. As WSLS 10's Christina Craig explains, city council is looking to draft an urban development proposal to help address needs for a growing city. Businesses, residential areas, marketplaces, and parking spaces are just some elements that Roanoke City leaders say foster an urban downtown design. What happened in the 70s and the 80s is tore down buildings, beautiful buildings for parking lots. We took two-way streets that worked great, made them one-way so people could flee to the suburbs faster. And we did some things that just weren't good for urban design. Now, with an active downtown, the Roanoke Planning Commission is looking to improve the urban layout of the city center. Some priorities on the city's to-do list is renovating vacant buildings or empty surface lots for retail and office spaces adding parking and shrubbery along the roadways and changing some one-way streets into two-way lanes which can create slower traffic and visibility to storefronts. One more thing is to try to create a network of green spaces or civic squares like the one we're standing in throughout the downtown. Or like the Wells Fargo Plaza. The goal is to bring in new retailers, offices and more residents. We can probably double the downtown population and not see uh, much in, in terms of negative impact. It's a change, chocolate paper, a staple in the downtown community welcomes. It's going to mean more customers coming in the store or walking by the store and we'll get more exposure that way uh, and that's good for any business. Come the spring of 2016, the Planning Commission will have a detailed draft. Then council will ask for public input in order to move forward. In Roanoke, Christina Craig, WSLS 10.